going to learn multiple motion tracking like the one you're watching right now then stay with me i'll show you how hey welcome to vc creator secret tutorials before we get started if you're new here i encourage you to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you will be notified when i publish new tutorials every week for more unique awesome videos like this check the links in the description below so without further ado let's get started hello welcome to another tips and tricks video in Fimoro on vccs tutorials channel well motion tracking is one of the coolest thing you could do in Fimoro and in this video i'm going to show you how to track not just one object but multiple objects and you can track as many objects as you want so without further ado let's dive right into it all right here are some of the videos some of the file i'm going to be using for this tutorial you can import yours to your medium so let's drag then our video to the track on the timeline let me play it for you. This is the video we're going to be using for our motion tracking. So the first thing we need to do is to duplicate it. Since we, we're going to be tracking three objects, three people riding bicycle, we're going to duplicate it into three layers so let's copy and paste on the second track and go to the third track and paste it now we have three layers so these are the layers we're going to be working on by the time we play it it looks as if it's just one video because the other two are blocking the first one so the first thing we need to do is to is to click on this eye icon in order to in order to make the two tracks invisible so click on those two icons and now we have just the first video playing let's move our playhead to exactly where we want the tracking to begin we're going to track the first person riding bicycle riding so double click on the video and go to motion tracking click on it and let's go back to the screen and minimize this box to fit exactly on the object we're tracking let's click on start tracking now now as you can see it is tracking it is tracking that particular object now when it's done now we can close it now we need something that it could track so we're going to use text instead so go to type 2 and, and drag down one of the plain text to the track on the timeline now double click on it and you can write whatever you want you can change the color the fonts just the way you want i'm going to type something right there type it and Place it right above the object. Expand the text to the same length with the video. Click on the video and come to the screen and choose the object you're tracking, which we're tracking text. So we're gonna see default lower third there. So choose that. That's the text we're gonna be tracking. So let's play it and see what we have. As you can see, you can see the tracking object. Now that's our first tracking. Now let's move the playhead forward and choose a place we want to start tracking the second one for. So let's go back to the second video on the track and, and uncheck the eye icon to make it visible. So double click on the video and go to motion tracking. Fix the box on the objects we're going to be tracking. Minimize it. Then click on start tracking and it will track the object. We'll wait for it. Alright, when it's done, you click OK. Now go back and let's drag then our text. Do the same thing. Write whatever you want. You can change the fonts, the, the color and order. When you're done, you drag and fix it exactly where you want it to be. Here we're going to place it above the objects we're, we're going to be tracking. That is the second bike man. The bike man in the middle. So drag it and place it right above it. So go 
go back and click on that same video and come back to this window and then you choose the text we're tracking and this is what we have now we have the text tracking the object now let's go back to the third track and uncheck the icon there to make it visible double click on it now let's find a place we want to start tracking from right there double click on the video and go to motion tracking now go back to the screen and move the box and place it right on the objects we're going to be tracking that is the third bite man make it fix exactly on the object we're going to be tracking then click on start tracking and it will track the object as you can see you can see it tracking the objects that's the bike man that said bike man now when it's done click ok let's go to type 2 and drag down the text and drop it there expand it to the same length with the video double click on the text and make some changes there just like i say you can write whatever you want to write you can change it you can use different colors and even fonts so right when you're done you drag it and place it right where you want it to be in this tutorial we're gonna place it right above the bike man that's the object we're tracking right above it so we're gonna drop we're gonna move it and drop it right there when you're done you click ok now double click on the video now let's go and link it to our text let's link the object we're tracking with the text that will be following now get back to this window and choose the object we're tracking and now you click ok let's preview it and see what we have that's it that's motion tracking that's this is how you track multiple objects and it doesn't matter how many objects you can do the same thing all you need to do is to follow the same process for tracking five objects you have to duplicate the video five times and you do the same to each and every one of them so this brings us to the end of the video i hope you enjoy the video for more tricks and tips don't forget to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends like it subscribe to the channel if you haven't and click the notification bell for more awesome videos like this thanks for watching I'll see you in the next video. Here is our final product. Check it out. video and find it valuable, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends so I can keep making them. For more awesome and unique videos like this, hit the subscribe button and remember to click on the notification bell. Also be sure to check out my other videos on this channel as well. And don't forget to leave a comment below, I love it. Be sure to watch the videos on the screen that we have picked for you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.